Hello and welcome back to Prison Architect. We're back here on Alpine Prison and this is our vanilla run through right here. So no grants, no mods, no nothing. So what are we going to do today? I think the main thing would be get a couple of the workshops up and running and also the infirmary as well. So I think we're going to go ahead and start with that right now. So let's go ahead and start with the building for the workshop. Now, I'm not too sure if I'm going to uh, leave this as one building or separate it down the middle and have two separate buildings. Uh, I guess uh, we'll just have to wait and see. So the first things first is actually, uh, let's go ahead and make the door. Where's the door? So we just need a normal door. Let's just put it right in the corner. Oh, uh, where should we put it? Where should we? Yeah. Yeah, let's just put it on that side right there. That's fine. So we got a door there. That's going to be uh, running, hopefully. Uh, we can get that done as soon as possible to get the prisoners working uh, in the following day right here. The following work day. So as you see, if we go into the regime, working from 12 to 5. Right there. Right there. So they got uh, a lot of work to do. After uh, we get a steady source of income, we can actually start putting down the metal detectors and maybe get some of the CCTVs up and running so uh, we know what's going on inside these buildings as I probably won't have enough guys to have patrols everywhere. Alright, so that is done. That is done. So let's just go ahead and try something. I just want to try something. I want to see if this works or not. Uh, if I put this entire thing as workshop, so let's go ahead and go into deployment, jobs, 15 max, okay. And uh, if, if I cut this in half, let's see, workshop, get rid of that, then what would happen to the jobs? Uh, apparently no one could work there. Okay. So apparently no one could work there uh, with that size. Um, that's weird. So if I make this one thing again, uh, staff deployment jobs 15 so let, let's this is gonna cost some money but it's all for experimentation just to see if this works or not and let's separate this by a wall so these two should count as two separate buildings now and we're getting more prisoners uh, very shortly that's gonna be okay let's see so we're gonna do that and see if that works and uh where are these guys? Okay, they're coming in now. And we're going to see if we can hire them on two separate locations. If so, then that will be good. If only we could hire more than 15. But this might be a waste of money. We'll see how this turns out. Alright, so prisoners going to be arriving soon. We're going to be uh, a little over capacity because it says uh, eight prisoners are arriving. So we're gonna have one more extra fellow running around. So I guess he's gonna be in the holding cell. Maybe I should put a bed there. But let's see. Now, okay, now the wall is done. Let's go into the utilities. No, not the utilities, what am I thinking? Deployment. Jobs. Seven, seven. That's only 14. All right, so that's not better, that's worse. We're at one. Just like the number of prisoners we have. <sighs> okay, then. Alright, you win. I'll just make one giant workshop. Just so I can have the uh, extra fellow working there. Alright. Okay. So, we can get rid of that then. Demolish that. And we could dismantle that because we need that. So, these are going to be just one giant workshops right here. Yeah. So that's what we'll do. Make them into one gigantic workshop. And uh, let's hire a few more guards now. So staff, you hire uh, that many. Uh, one more cook. Two more cooks. So two more cooks. Hire the psychologist. And I think everyone is hired now. Well, why does he get the biggest office? That is messed up. Uh, 
Oh, well, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? And the door is in a box. It's in a box. Alright, and then, uh, let's see. Let us see what am I doing. Workshop. There we go. Change that into one big thing. And where should we put the saws and presses? So there's uh, 14 things there, and then there's gonna be 15 guys in there, and one guy could be running around, whatever, whatever, whatever he wants to be doing. And we just need to attach the cables now. Um, let's see. Utilities. Alright, so that's gonna be connected. And uh, how's this gonna hold up? I think I'm gonna wanna add a couple extra capacitors here just in case. And did pe did someone get released? Why, why is it down? Oh, is it is it? Oh yeah, I hired the psychologist thing. Okay, okay, okay. And uh, let's see, we have a couple grand or two grand left, pretty much. So let's put a bed here. There we go. Just for that uh, one fellow that is stuck in here. And should we make a separate uh, shower area as well? Let's see. How can we design this? The toilets are like that. We just like that. Free showers, free showers, free showers, free showers. Alright, so let's get the elbow here. And then, shower. Oh, that's a nice shower. We need a drain as well, like that. And, uh, got the pipes. There we go. The pipes are like that. And we'll go down that as well. We love it. That's it. There we go. And where is the shower? Where is the shower? Shower, 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 shower. Where is the shower? Here we go. There we go. So inside the holding cell, we have a little area for shower and toilets. So if uh, we can have three over capacity of the total prison. So if that happens, then at least they can uh, use these facilities over here to keep them happy. And uh, all right, so they're, it's time to eat. Come on, you guys didn't even work. All right, fine, fine. I guess we have to wait for the next day to make some money. Deployment controls. Last guy in the workshop. And we got four on spare walking around doing whatever they're doing. So that's good for now. I see that one guy's happy, right? Yeah, comfort of sleep, doing all his uh, doha. He's all good. These guys, what are they doing? Just uh, sitting around. All right, all right. That's good. And uh, what's this? Four have serious complaints. Well, what complaints do you have? What complaints do you have, huh? Tell me. Needs nothing. Clothing. Well, you got clothes right there. Why don't you change it? Because uh, it's right there. You can change it. Exercise. What? Oh, ooh, ooh, I should have a yard. Ooh, whoops. The yard's not even too expensive. I just have to label it, so, uh... There's the yard. And, uh... Let's put a couple work benches or white benches here. One, two, three white benches. There we go. Start off with that. And, uh, the next day they should be, uh, happy. Get that all done. So, sleep, food, hygiene. Well, what do you want? What do you want? Huh? We got a big common room, so they should be all happy there. And hopefully the recording's uh, a little bit more smooth now. I didn't really have to do this before, but... Well, I did it for when I played Half-Life, setting the CPU affinity. So, right now, Prison Architect is running on the first four cores. Uh, threads, or whatever you want to call it, you know, I... And then the Fraps is running on uh, the last four. So it's running on four and four. And hopefully that's smoothing out the process. I'm not too sure if it is or not. Uh, hopefully they're not going to start, you know, fighting and bickering. If they do, then uh, I don't know. That's going to cause some problems now, isn't it? Anyways. 
it seems like it's recording more smoothly. I did try recording at half size and uh, the quality was abysmal. I was not happy with quality as everything looked a little too fuzzy. So I'm just like, you know what? It's not good. It's not good enough. We must go back to full size, full 1080. So that's what I'm doing right now. And I don't know why, I don't know why uh, it would lock up and freeze. It has to be a limitation with the hard drive, I think. But it does feel a little bit smoother. Um, but I didn't have to do that before. So maybe it's because I moved the hard drive. I changed the port from... Uh, the SATA 3 gigs to the 6 gigs and it's on the Intel controller right now maybe, maybe it doesn't like that so I guess this guy's gonna be transferred to a cell and uh, they got free time right now so all these guys I want exercise they're getting their exercise and it is going down it's plummeting yes everyone's happy look at that oh well treated oh good job guys good job so uh, we got guys doing recreation, guys having fun, guys eating. Okay, so uh, they're getting all their food. I think we have to put it on a tray here soon. So let's go ahead and do that right now. So let's put a serving table right here. There we go. We got a little extra serving table. And uh, hopefully they got a lot of work done, making me a lot of money. But uh, for now, I think uh, we got a lot done we got the workshop done that took all the money I had actually I probably didn't have to put uh, all these uh, equipment here in one time but uh, next time we're gonna try to get the infirmary up so we're gonna go ahead and save some money to get that done and uh, for now this is it and uh, I just want to say thank you for watching I hope you guys enjoyed and of course until next time I'll see you guys later